pandemic has dealt a very hard blow to the tourism industry in Namibia. Many tourism businesses have had to close down or are on the verge of closing down. Many jobs have been lost. Many livelihoods are at stake, more so with every passing day. It is absolutely critical for the survival of our industry to get tourists back into our beautiful country to revive this important economic pillar in Namibia. To achieve this, we need to make Namibia as enticing as possible for our international guests. We need to stand out as a safe destination with easy access to testing and top-class medical facilities. The private sector roadblock COVID testing initiative is aimed at making it easier for tourists and travelers to get tested. Mobile testing facilities have been put up at the Windhoek Okaanja and Windhoek Rearboth roadblocks. Whilst this initiative is aimed at the tourist sector, everyone who needs COVID testing can make use of the facilities. The pandemic has impacted and changed our outlook on how we work, how we live, how we do business how we interact with one another, and last but not least, how we should sustain and protect the continued well-being of our people. It is against this background that COVID test NAM initiated this project to conduct PCR and rapid antigen tests at the key points of entry, which include Okahanja, as well as railroad roadblocks. The aim focuses on tourism travelers coming to the end of their trip, will enter the city from both north and south bounds of the B1 road. The initiative is to revive the tourism industry by providing an efficient and convenient product that is mandatory to the travelers prior to cross borders needing to test against COVID-19, with the main focus being set on customer service. The COVID-19 test team on hand consists of well-experienced Namibians with extensive knowledge in the tourism industry who lost jobs due to the pandemic. We also partnering with young, vibrant Namibian graduate nurses that have been serving the Namibian population and are willing to go a step further in contributing to the revival of the Namibian tourism sector and future projects under the COVID test name to help fight this pandemic. Kalumbi Shangula applauded the private sector for the initiative, noting that this will surely have a positive contribution to the upliftment of the industry as the tourism industry is one of the sectors that expands and contributes to the economy of Namibia. The COVID-19 situation in Namibia remains critical. The number of confirmed COVID-19 cases continue to increase. Namibia have reached and surpassed 50,000 confirmed COVID-19 cases. The increasing number of cases calls for greater vigilance on the part of the Libyans. To learn the Tourism and Safari Association and the pathology service providers for this timely initiative. At present, Namibia compares favorably with other African countries in terms of COVID-19 testing. Statistics shows that as at the 9th of May 2021, that is yesterday, Namibia has tested on average 160 persons per thousand populations, which compares well with South Africa at 181, and Morocco at 156 persons per 1,000 1, populations, respectively. There is no doubt that the initiative we are launching this morning will strengthen Namibia's overall capacity to conduct COVID-19 tests. Whereas at the beginning of the pandemic, we did not have the capacity to test for COVID-19. We now have 10 laboratories that are testing for COVID-19. 
We have also developed the capacity to identify the type of COVID-19 variants, the variants that are circulating in Namibia. Shangbula further urged Namibians to pull and work together to curb COVID-19 by wearing their masks, social distancing, and go for the vaccinations and ignore those that are trying to mislead the nation on the safety of the vaccines.